Good morning, friends. Welcome back. And today we are at Tele Tower, Tallinn Tele Tower. And this is the twenty-first floor, where we have a great panoramic view of the city. And with this Tele Tower, you can cover closely close to somewhere 90 kilo, square kilometer of the range to have this TV transmission. So we have a visit here because of our Estonian class, A1. Uh, oops. And you can see the Bay of Finland from here as well. Is this the botanical garden? Yeah. yeah. And what you can see here is the botanical garden right in the center. Where we will visit. Oh, okay, that is Pirita Monastery, yeah? At one o'clock from you. Oh, wow. Great. We can see, and we can see Yesti Kelemaya. Yeah, yeah, just behind Kelemaya. the Radisson. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Yes. Great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And they were saying that we could see also the skyline of Finland, Helsinki, from yeah. here. So maybe, maybe from here. Yeah. So now because of the, um, say, no traffic of the cruise lines between Estonia and Finland, there is, they say that you can see the skyline of Finland from here. So we're going to try it a little bit and let's see if we can see that. It could be a little difficult, I guess. Have a look at these beautiful houses and such a green landscape amid this forest. And this is just 10-15 minutes from the city center. So it's quite beautiful. And in Estonia you are never far from the nature. And you have one wonderful thing here. So you can stand on this glass like this. It is hazy, opaque and all of a sudden then you can see that it turns into transparent glass where you can have the view and they have a button here to do that so I'm going to do that yes please do it yes so you can have a look here and you can find out that you're standing right on top of this glass and if you are not aware and if you are scared of the height, the phobia, then you certainly will get scared. And this is a port of Muga, Muga port. And we have our friend Rob from UK and sweet little girl, Agatha. Wow, Agatha, Tere. Again, one more beautiful view here. Kind of see 
maybe the view of Helsinki from here a little bit of skyline it's very thin a little difficult maybe you could enjoy it better with binoculars Look at these beautiful houses here. And Helsinki just across this bay, Bay of Finland. And in two hours you can be in Helsinki from Tallinn. Great amazing view. This is the inside. So you can click this button and then again you can do this. see a small igloo like structure where they have a restaurant and also they have a restaurant on top as well where we'll be heading later video you come on YouTube yeah. so our friend Anna <laughs> yeah. Waga here and you can have a view here it's a very beautiful restaurant and let's go outside have a look outside Palun Anna Palun let's go outside come for food later yeah please hang on and we are going out to have a look at the view Thanks. 
you can put your folds. So no smoking allowed. Oh, look at this. And you can also go this way out by paying a small fee and sit here with a protective gear. Very peaceful, very quiet. Take a little walk around. Hello. I'm right to the table. Yeah. Hi, yeah, Looks hecked. You can see some cruises around and these beautiful houses. Or rather villas as well, you can call. Small binocular to have a spectacular view. www. hispview com Yeah, and you can see, for example, the botanical garden there. So I highly recommend you to register for Estonian classes at AST Kelemaya if you plan to live in Estonia. It's better to highly recommend it rather to learn Estonian and join AST Kelemaya where they also take you out for real excursions so that you learn practically not just in the classroom but also outside and interact Thanks for joining. Take care. Stay safe. Have a great day. Thank you. So we have a special food arranged all the way by Esti Kelemaya for us and would like to show you what we have here today. Such a wonderful food. We have delicious salmon with Estonian bread and a dill sauce. Then we have the roasted chicken salad, celery. Then we have this uh, beet and cheese salad 
auch. Liuba, you can sit there if you want. And you make an aeroplane and shoot it out from here. So here the issue. Here the issue. Bon appetit. Guten appetit. Here the issue. Here the issue. Follow, follow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And also this brownie. Olga. Olga. Olga, I hope these are not your brownies. <laughs> Just kidding. Wow. Rob, Olga's brownies. Olga's, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> we, we keep getting served them until they finish it. Yes, yes. So here we step out of the TV tower. I'm just going to show you a little bit around. This is just 10 meter, just 10 meter shorter than Eiffel Tower. You can have more information about TV Tower, Tallinn, on the website. Just Google Tallinn TV Tower and you'll get... Yeah. Yes. You'll get the ah, okay. subsequent uh, information, all related information about the restaurant and everything that it has. So we are heading to the Botanical Garden in Tallinn. Very beautiful. We will see inside, and I can see some. Mm -hmm. Oh, what is this? Uh, the tulips. Tulips. Yeah. Wow, very beautiful, oh, beautiful. tulips. Uh, purple color, orange, mm -hmm. yellow, some yeah. white. Wow, Wagayulus. So Today's beautiful day. Yes, very beautiful. It's currently 18 degrees. Yeah. Christopher, Rolf and Christopher, uh, Rob. We'll try to send this video to Margarita can watch them. So it looks like some under construction, some expansion going on. Tõenäoliselt Ja ka Eestis oli siis ka iluajendus ja teised, teised talu, iluajendus on kui algus ja teised talud käis, kas on talud ja talumehed ja talu kui käidis kõrkimas tema juures. Selline ajalooline koht. Ja tema puusi ajast me korrekti minu kohtus tema talu. Wow, that's great. 
is great, yes. Do you know what's it? Do you know what's it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. This is for Margarita. I will say, I mean, just I'm uh, shooting this. So, Margarita, you can enjoy this.
hard.
Yeah. Nothing annoys me more than the Americanization of English. And yeah. The poor use of English but, by generations. But having said that, yeah. the English that I speak yeah. is, is totally unrecognisable from the English that was spoken in the 15 and 16 and 1700s in England. Yeah. The language For sure. cha changes, doesn't it? For sure. And yeah, I've so. been, uh, I've been uh, once from... No, Venice to Rome by yeah. train, and I, oh, as I told you, and I that I, was nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And uh, I met one guy from young chap from Manchester, yeah. and what he was talking, I really you couldn't, couldn't understand. understand. No. I mean, no. not, I'm like oh, it, it, well. his accent. If he had a strong, strong, very accent, strong, uh, that, that would be uh, hard to understand. Yeah, but also his slang, probably as well. Yeah. So I couldn't understand so easily. And no, I'm like, oh, no, what, no. What is this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. But also, after being ruled by the British for more than 150 years, yeah. today, if you see in India, Indians would understand American English far easier than British English. Than English, English yeah.